Hey there, everyone. How's it going? Of course, Awakening's good. And I love that you picked that over Fates. <laughs> Excited for three houses, I am. I'm gonna finish the first version. I lost interest. It just was like, this isn't grabbing me. Granted, apparently, Conquest is not the best version, but yeah. I like having Bahamut, but let's Bring a goblin with me. This is such a good song. I only played Final Fantasy 3 once. It's a good game, but... You haven't talked to me about that. I do enjoy 3, though. I mean, it's the very basic job... It's the most basic job system, because... I don't think they really knew what they were going to do with it yet. Mm -hmm. 
Also, I'm surprised you didn't say Pokemon. I'm not even talking about randomizing it. That's what I'm saying. I've only played the Pokemon games once. And yet you always delete your saves. I don't see it having that much of an after. After game. Enough. <sighs> Earth Talons. That's neat. I can't. This is gonna annoy me now? Yes! Okay. So presentive with you. That's why I came in here to deal with it. You're being picked up like 90% on the mic. You better not leave that in here. And yet you did last time. Uh, I hate that Balrogs have barriers. Oh, just take all my magic after you put a barrier up, dickbag. Yeah, I'm not going into that because that might be a dual trap and I'll probably die. I was super happy last night when I was going through this. Going through to get us. Oh, fuck. That's gonna hurt. Ow, motherfucker. I would certainly hope so. Slow burner! Do I have all the dragons? No, I need four more BP to get dark dry. Okay, good. I keep thinking Fire Emblem when I see Dark Dragon, because the first game. Ah, oh, shit. Shit, shit, I... One floor away! Fuck it, Warp Wings, bring me closer. That... That is... Technically closer, but not what I meant, game. Not me. The love.
Oh no, you took away my one SP. Fucker put up another fucking barrier. Hey, Balrog, pro tip. Nobody likes a barrier. Are you fucking kidding me? I was literally one guy away from a fucking level up. I was didn't do anything because I didn't want to fucking die. I didn't want to heal because I, I, I had a heal because I didn't want to die. Because I was afraid he would cast flare again like a dick bag. Guess I have to fight. Raphael to see you here. Stay back, Chocobo, please. I don't want to hurt you. You're like a cockroach. Are you really so obsessed with your so-called friends? Can't hold on. Chocobo, you have to run. I am Raffaello. Guardian beast of darkness and destroyer of this world. Witness the power of the void. So, since you're levitating, does, I hope that means you count as a floater. Well, I'm dead. That's it. Good night, everyone. No, I'm kidding. In the end, that's all you had. Farewell, light of the world. Soon. The planets will be enveloped in darkness. Now I will drag everything into the darkness. He does. I know. Meanwhile, I just got absorbed into a the void. So hey. That Chocobo? I need a drink after that scene. You're still fighting, ain't ya? You got this, Chocobo. Uh, we believe in you, Chocobo. Tower of friendship. We're sending all our memories. Well, to they you. are the three sa other sages, so. The power of the fire crystal to stoke the flames of your courage. The power of the water crystal to wash away all obstacles. I get the feeling this is gonna somehow bring uh, Chroma back, since she's the dark the oracle. The Don't you know I just need the power of friendship? Really? You were saying think of the same thing? Chocobo, take our strength. Our friendship trumps go. I don't expect elaborate writing from this series where the first what? where the prequel what? to this game was about magical storybooks so i don't expect anything deep okay it's going to be very cliche and very tropey so 
Apparently I'm Gilgamesh now. Listen to this. By the power of Gilgamesh, you will die. <laughs> well, the music is. Sticking their noses where they Pretty sure this is belong. where they belong. Chocobo. Thank goodness. I can feel everything. Is this to note that Battle of the Big Bridge is the power of friendship? Please. The music of friendship is Gilgamesh. Idiots. You realize what that means, don't you? Don't you? Chocobo, quick! Can I beat you up while you're in control so I can just, you just stand there and get hit? Do me a favor. Take control, and not like everyone else in the world, I'll actually stab you. I poisoned him. Who knows that? If, if the curry wanted to still have control, strike me down. I wouldn't hesitate for a fucking minute. I would strike him down. I'm like, okay, cool. Uh, Finally, fuck. Wait, when does oh, his poison already wore out? Wow. Hey, should I try to immobilize him so he can't fucking move everywhere? It's probably not gonna work, but I wanna try. It worked! Uh, it means he won't be moving all over the fucking place. Unless I hit him, of course. Yes, immobilize him and then kick him across. That's a good idea. His heart is resisting. Okay, so power smack again. I'm just gonna bitch slap him with my sword until he gives up. I'm a bird. I know not of these things called morals. Ow. But he's all the way over there now. I'm gonna use an X potion while he's halfway across the room. Okay. Man, I sure I'm glad my immobilized spellbook has multiple uses. Stay still, asshole, so I can beat the shit out of you. Wow, just fucking magic break right after I heal myself. Yeah. Dick. That's gonna hurt. Does not have with good. Stay over there, away from me, so I can do this. And that did nothing. Damn it. <laughs> That's what I was trying to set up this whole time and it, it, it did nothing. What did that mean? The goggles, they do nothing. The explosive drink.
It did literally zero damage, yeah. So time to just bitch slap him some more. I just thought it was going to do a decent amount of damage. Well, I won't get in trouble for that. Why would I get in trouble for... I already forgot the context of that. And he's dead! Dead! I'm kidding, that that is not it. That cannot be it. The power of Gilgamesh compelled me. Well, Neo X death music is playing now, so. He's been devoured by the void. Goodbye. Goodbye. And thank you. No. It looks like he takes up multiple spaces. This is great. The fuck? You saw those. Well, that looks painful. I have no idea what the fuck's going on right now. I will consume everything. I will eliminate everything. I will return all things to darkness. Okay, Ansem. The time of darkness has come. I am the god of destruction. Do, do you have a name? Oh, the Destroyer. They've been telling you about the Destroyer this entire time. I thought he might have a proper name. <laughs> I didn't know that he was the Destroyer this whole time. I did. I thought he had a proper name. No, nope, the Destroyer is... Man, I wish I hadn't wasted it is my... Proper, uh... babe. It's the Destroyer. Well, I got fully healed. That's nice. Oh no, he used anxiety, my one weakness. I wanted to add that quote, okay? I thought it was a good one. Should I try to slow him? I'm gonna try to slow him. He's got slowed! His heart is still resisting! Wow, sucks to be you, bro. By the way, I'm reasonably certain that he counts as a floater. Uh, I just want to show you my uh, skills and look at number five. Oh, good, good. <laughs> I got those for the annoying ass fucking Arimans, but <laughs> the final boss works. <laughs> I'm dealing almost 500 damage a pop with it while well, boosted, okay? Pretty sure it's working. You can't deal more than a thousand. I'm dealing half cap. So why do you have a weak goblin? 
Uh, because he get he he has bravery. He gives me bravery. How, that, that's how I'm dealing so much damage. Also, he isn't slowed like my Iron Giants. Iron Giants are perma-slow. So he, I don't have to wait for his turn to come about to, brave, to put bravery on myself. Oh no, he used anxiety again. Uh, it's just his warp thing. From what I can tell, let's see, Turbo Ether. Let me give you a Turbo Ether, bro. I'll give you a High Ether. You're not worthy of my Turbo Ethers! Because you only have 4 SP max, bro. No, you never have health bars for enemies in this game. Should probably do this. Safety. This isn't going this isn't going too terribly I have to say he's gonna warp again also look how cute my little goblin friend is a planner need to use gob friend help gob friend <sighs> Now I'm gonna heal. Did he just normally attack me finally. Well, that's because I had bravery on and I was using my special ability. I need to stop healing my goblin friend, otherwise I'm not going to have any heals for myself. Unless I pick up these heals that are conveniently around the arena. And he's dead. Nothing I could do about that. An elixir? Those are in this game?
Oh, well, if your heart's resisting, okay, bye. He's probably gonna start glowing when he gets into critical health, and since he hasn't yet... So his rampage can also take away my buffs, so... We summon Phoenix. That sounds good, right? Well, it looks like that was the only elixir on this floor, so... Still not glowing. God damn, how much health does this asshole have? Yep. Well, my rays just wore off with his, because he can negate that apparently. That's always good. Hey, he's glowing. Yeah, except now I have no more heals. No, I have one. Okay. I have one heal. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. That didn't murder me. That's good. I'm immobilized right now because of that, though.
Okay, so I think his rampage is just a uh, two by two square directly in front of him. And if he's that far away, I'm gonna risk it. I'm gonna use my angel's robe right now. Uh, negates magic. Yeah, now my mono wards wore off though, and I don't have a second chance at that, so. Gathering power again. I have no way to heal. No, there aren't. You just heal for 750. Are you just gonna... Yep. And I'm dead. No way I can really avoid this. was bullshit. That was such bullshit. I mean, fuck. He had to have been close to death, and the fact he's able to heal for that much... <sighs> After No, he couldn't have. He would have had to do that literally every turn for like 10 turns. Why do you think that was him getting close to full health? About to say how low health you have. Daddy, my max health is a lot. I don't know how much I don't. A six thirty. Yeah, but he's the final boss. He's not gonna have comparable health to me. Okay, so what I'm gonna do this time, I'm gonna save the uh, Phoenix until that point. If I'm lucky, uh, I'll get down to the Bob and I'll already be in that phase. You know?
either way, it's nice that I have... I'm pretty sure I was dealing a lot because of that, so... And, uh, I also... Oh, I should get the strength collar. Don't really need the... Fuck, I lost it. Oh, well. What do you mean, how it... No. We got water to about... This high. In it the other day. No, the water got, like, from the base of the tub to about here. To be in it. Before it got cold. Okay. Don't do that! Huh? Don't do that! To do what? Tr risk dropping your phone! Fine, I won't then. Put in a Ziploc bag like I do. Okay, fine. Me too. Sorry, that was just kind of stupid. I'm sorry. Oh, well, sorry. Hey, buddy! Hey, buddy! Hey, buddy! Yeah. Okay, let's try this again. Maybe not with Goblin, because he died horribly. I think I will use, uh... Maybe I'll poison him, huh? Oh, I have Dark Dragon now. Nice. I have every dragon. Kinda hoping that I get I'll be able to skip the first phase because I got now that I've been to the second, because that would help immensely. And sometimes games are nice like that. Sometimes they're not. Really? You're gonna be that much of a dick?
Let me see if I can't get any turbo ethers. That is not a huge amount of damage, fuck you. I didn't even hit you once. Go ahead and cure, though. God damn it. Oh. Nobody likes barriers, ball rock. Fuck you.
sadly, it's inferior to this by quite a bit. Six slots, and it's better than what I currently have, and more importantly, it won't rust automatically. So that's a free, that's a slot I'll have freed up. Now I can't get cursed. Can't be put to sleep. I can't be silenced. That was uh, worth it, I'd say. Like that is, that is. Like, this is worse, but these are better than what I had. all that money. It's money I've been building up since the start of the game. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. But hey, I have more powerful attacks now, so that's nice. I'm going to change my buddy because this Really, a lot of damage in front did not do fucking shit. I still have to see two types there and two types there.
Obviously, I need to shank him. That's the only solution. I need to shank him. That is a really nice sword knife he has. Look at that thing. It's all fucking ornate and shit. the same one I was following that entire floor who knew he was just leading me to the exit how nice See, the other reason I want to bring Tonberry is not because he's strong. Well, I mean, he kind of is this special ability. Nice, more trident talents. Those are always nice. But also because Tonberry don't give a fuck about magic.
Thank you for the finisher, Tomberry Bra. Well, this is silly. I had a gut feeling when I entered this room right here that the exit was going to be up this way. saw that coming. Ah, fuck. Ah! Hi. It worked in my favor. Watch the next five floors be fucking din monster dense. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah, level up. Okay, just gotta get through this next floor. I think that really makes the boss hard is the wear and tear of the stage. Yeah, but that's not really an it. I mean with items. Yeah, but Not really a concern here 
Got two herb turbies, got an explosive drink, got one angel's robe, got that, got... Do we have to do the first phase again? Most likely, it is a Final Fantasy game after all. Good, good. Just announce that to the whole world. Yes! I skipped the first phase! how much damage this does none but it slows him without knocking him back so there's that just takes all his SP whatever Hurt Tonberry. Sorry, Tonberry. Now. Does nothing to him either. Oh well. It's worth a shot, right? Sorry, Tom Barry. Yeah, I saw that happening. Right? that chance to pick that up. Let me hurt. Nope. I guess it can't be on diagonals because that would be complicated. I don't know. Or maybe he locks onto me and then does it. I'm still trying to figure that out. Didn't get nearly as many turbo ethers as I would have liked. That's gonna hurt. Oh well. At least it doesn't do anything to me, really.
Well, that was a perfect usage of that. Yeah. Totally took advantage. I fucking... That's not really doing enough. I like that he attacks with a clock hand. Really brings home the idea of time being important in this game, you know? I bought 10 X potions, so hopefully I'm prepared this time. a wasted iron slot in our turn. Oh. Well, the explosive drink was null on the first form. I thought maybe the second would be different. It's not like I went out of my way to get it. Oh, look. He's... Wow. He's, uh, already, uh... Huh. Apparently... Where the hell is to be? Dead. No, he died early on. I didn't even heal him once. Uh, he was slow. And he's just gonna spam this shit now. And I can't really do anything about it. That's gonna hurt. gonna heal again? Yeah. I know, but to be fair, I'm spamming my most powerful attack on him, so... 
Probably we're gonna have five minutes. Gathering power. And he's cornered me, which means if he I get hit with Flummox. It's very unlikely that'll be knocked back a space, so... Art is resisting and I can't do shit since I'm so far away. Really? You're gonna fucking... He's done that before, but... Maybe it really wants to be hit by Ragnarok. I think that's it. Uh, <laughs> well, something's gonna happen, that's for sure. Third four! That's not even my final four. I know, right? Let's see. It's gonna become a statue of a bunch of weird objects he had to kill very slowly uh, while he laughs at you. Well, it's loading a lot, so... He sounds in pain. I have to fight the claws individually. And they're right. Well, you shouldn't have been floating, because then I wouldn't have dealt so much damage to you. <laughs> oh, they're powering down. I think I just beat the game. I don't think I actually beat the Wii version. I don't remember this at all. Like sands through the hourglass, so are the days of our lives. Oh, okay, really? <laughs> yes! Hey, that show had Dr. Drake Ramore in, don't you forget it. <laughs> oh fuck, I have to fight the stage now. Darkness with that, the Dark Beast was actually from the former Oracle of Darkness, he, uh, Pastor Roche. He actually tells you that. The Temple of Dark? Yeah. It's falling apart! But he didn't realize that. By releasing, re removing it from himself, I wouldn't really have any good or bad. Well, I'm dead. I just fucking exploded. That was a lot faster than most final <laughs> dungeon <laughs> explode <laughs> destructions. <laughs> Damn it! Don't Think you know you have to give us at least five minutes to escape from a blowing up? Dude, Final Fantasy VI, you freaking have Kefka's Tower crumbling, and the fir and the whole section of that is ten minutes long as they escape it. This is just like, okay, it's rumbling, it's falling apart, it's rumbling, it explodes, and that's it. It's like... It speed ran its own destruction. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh look, puzzle pieces are just falling out of the sky now. Uh, it's a Chocobo themed music box version. I destroyed the sky box. What have I done? <laughs> I mean, you destroyed the air because that's a real box. That was a protective barrier. Oh, wow. wow, that's it? I'm just it, dead? That, I'm just really dead? Die. Hey, here's the cast, though. This is what I've been curious about. Okay. Erica Mendez is Sherman. Yeah, Faye Mata, Erica Harlicker. Nice. Yeah, I already knew about all these. Wait, what the fuck happened to Chroma? <laughs> oh, yeah, Mog is, uh... Jamieson Price. I fucking knew it. Chocobo, who the fuck knows? Nobody was Chocobo. The, re the real Chocobo was the friends we made along the way. Well, Chocobo died. <laughs> I know, right? Wow. I exploded. Everybody but Chocobo. Well, it is a mystery dungeon game, and if I've learned anything from the Pokemon mystery dungeon games, it's that the ending is always heart-wrenching, so... <laughs> yeah! You're playing this happy-go-lucky game with cute characters, and it's like, oh, this is so adorable, and then you get to the final story, and... Do you mind if I tell you what happens at the end of Explorers? What? You get erased from time. Because you're from the future, the dark future. And since you rewrite the future, you no longer exist. Wow. So your character, so your partner is just like, I wish you could stay, and you literally erase yourself from time. Yeah. No, except you just don't exist anymore. Except for post-game, they just pull some bullshit where your partner Rish is so strongly for you to come back, you come back, and now you can post-game. But yeah, it's like, and Red Re and the Rescue Team games are also like, what the fuck? If I, it's been a while since I played those, but if I remember correctly, it's that you go back to the human world. So it's not as heart-wrenching. Super Mystery Dungeon is also pretty heart-wrenching. It's like, what the fuck? Oh shit. Bar my charger, just unplug mine. Phone? Yes. I'm well aware. So yeah, I beat the game. Ooh! Good, it's ice cream time. No, I, I still have post game to do. I need to see how Chocobo survived. Good. But yeah, I'm 99% sure that Jamieson Price voiced, uh, Bahamut. Because he, he's one of the younger knights, I think, in, uh, Seven Deadly Sins. And he always plays someone who has, like, a deep voice. Actually, I need to double check something. Uh... Is he? Don't worry about it. No, that's okay. Yosuke Matsuda. Shinji Hashimoto. Yeah, he's the boss. Persona 5. So Jiro, Jamieson Price, always has that deep, kind voice. Like, that's the perfect way to describe it, right? Am I just gonna fall from the fucking sky? Yep, I'm falling from the- I'm a bird of- Chocobo, you're not supposed you're to fly black, in that direction. Though, oh, there you go. Huh? Not black, See, I never used my angel's rope, so obviously I used that, got mono ward, and the explosion didn't affect me. Obviously. The air <laughs> How did the air Cause it's the Lunar Whale! I'm kidding, that's the song. Seaside Park. Let's go! Seaside Park? Where the fuck's Seaside Park? Is that where I fish? It's where I fish. Sid obviously put autopilot in it. You doubt the power of Sid? The R2D2. Yeah, that crystal. 
Well, you thought the uh, you thought BBA was revolutionary with the crystal with the round shape. What do you see the crit diamond shape? <laughs> BB8 in uh, the sequel trilogy, which people thought was CGI, but no, he's a hundred percent real. Mm -hmm. Obviously not with the actual being a legitimate robot, but it's an actual prop that rolls around. Chocobo. Get, get, get. Fucking right, I survived you. Yeah, just throw me in the water. Yeah, thanks, Sherma. Hey, you know the best way to greet someone who survived? Try to kill them by breaking their neck. I know, right? She almost suplexed me. Uh, wait a minute. Where the fuck's Chroma? Uh, are we forgetting you about Chroma? Dead. I know, right? Buddy, you made it. You did it, Chocobo! You saved everybody! Uh, who are you guys? Uh, oh, now they react! Um. Oh, there they are! Right. You know who they are! Raffaello? Sis? Chroma? Is that Who else you? would it be? Sherma. Everyone. I'm sorry. Once I realized. Forget it. Everyone's happy, right? So what does it matter? It's thanks to you two that we got these memories back. You're an NPC, you'd be the guy in the goggles. He's the king of the city. You huh. would still be living he in limbo. Forgetting over I know, right? That's why his representation is and it's thanks to Chocobo that Sis could come back. Here, here, here. I, I'd like to point out the destroyer shows up. Oh, everyone forgot. I know, right? The hell of ranks. Oh, the Pell of Oblivion. No, I don't think that's what it is anymore. This bell rings for the memories of the past and the new future ahead. It's the bell of evocation. Who let Sid name it? He just showed up a down already gets the well, name to be the fair, bell. Evocation is the reverse of oblivion. I know. So you're it literally is summoning. So good name for that then? You're... Yes. I I like to point out. So the destroyer comes about, literally kills people. Yeah. Remember how the girl she the she remembered she had a kid named Matt? Yeah, yeah he fucking died. Just straight up. I can now bring Raffaello along as my buddy. Chapter 6, The Town of Fountain. It seems that Raffaello also fought but his yeah. hardest against the Destroyer. The Destroyer comes, literally kills people, fucking. They have no choice. The only way they can defeat him is by stealing away their memories. I'm a cute little yellow bird. I show up, I fix everyone's memories, and beat the shit out of the Destroyer and kill him. You guys are pathetic. It's once again <laughs> a game of oops, we helped the villain. I know, but then we beat the shit out of him. It's like, you guys had literal warriors that fucking died. I'm a bird, and I won. You guys are pathetic. <laughs> Let's see, how, how many times is oops, we Until now, <laughs> this town has uh, always lost time. Well, From now eight. on, we will carve it out ourselves. Thank you so Great. very much. Great. You saved our town. Your heroes. <laughs> Being called a hero to your face is kind of embarrassing. And thus, yes. on this spot, in honor of and with heartfelt gratitude to our dear friend Chocobo, we hereby dedicate this commemorative. Not very flattering. My eyes are very pixelated and low texture. That's really I would have just put it in Fat Chocobo, anyways. Uh, so where's mine? Ah, uh, yeah. Sadly, we ran low on materials. But your name's on it, see? Who, where? Let me see. In honor of the hero Chocobo and his partner Sid. That's it? Just partner? Sheesh. <laughs> 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 
Congratulations! Thanks to all of Chocobo's hard work, the town of Lost Time has become the town of Found Time, where past and future memories meet as one. But the adventure isn't over yet. Chapter 6 features a new story and new dungeons to explore, and it appears something has been added to Blue Sky Park. Why not go and have a look? Is this it? Is this the thing? The thing that the game very explicitly showed me? Okay, first, I need to check things. There is one very important thing I must investigate. Nice, lots of stuff. So I guess if I wanted to go back to the Tower of Dark, uh, I, the tem Temple of Dark, I'd have to use the mirrors. Wait. The most important thing I can check. The jukebox! the same song just more upbeat that's great wow Salonia that's which one it was right I knew it was Final Fantasy 3 awakening is it yeah battle Raffaello battle at the big bridge Decisive battle, Final Fantasy V. Oh, so it's normal exit, not Neo exit. That was wrong. The ending from the world's tomorrow, Chocobo Racing. Huh. Okay, well, you can go ahead and, uh, continue playing. I'm going to get entry. Wait for me to finish. Welcome. I don't want to quit just yet. I want to explore a tiny bit more. Hello, Choke. Okay, let's see if that guy has a... just said he he oh. he said something on discord but in chat he only said he he let's see oh wait there's something else I need to check mog's red book For gang, a self-help book for veteran dungeoneers. Let's see what this book is. I've been waiting. The time has come, and so have I. Now it's a Final Fantasy reference. Is this just a normal ass dungeon? It is just a normal ass dungeon. A really short one, but it's probably gonna be very painful. I'm expecting to die in one hit. Oh, never mind. How about I just start off with a Ragnarok for fun? Oh shit! Oh my god, is this what I think it is?
I think this dungeon's meant for grinding quickly. Because the enemies are pretty weak, but 147, 152, 153. J uh, that's how much JP I just got from three things, but the enemies aren't, like, broken strong. Nice. Gotta love a dungeon for grinding. Knowing how... Because they... It's like they know how... Meteor book? Fuck! Filling greens. Let's see what the duel is. being a dick. Then again, lizards usually are. That was a lot of fucking health. Kidding me? Do not fucking. 298 JP from that guy. Almost 10,000 fucking. Yeah, I'm not gonna do the dual stats because those guys have a lot of HP. Dry ethers just dropped like that. Nice. Okay, only 404 JP to go. Against sleep, poison, blindness, silence, mobilization, confusion, attack reduction, and defense reduction. I know, right? Now 
if only I could get that as a badge on a fucking piece of gear. Job level gained. And with that... So let's check this ultimate move out, shall we? If I can find someone to hit with it. I'm not going to use it on the light elemental, that's for sure. That would be dumb. It's only going to do one damage if I do it on the light elemental. Behold! Camelot. It does damage to enemies in the uh, air in the squares around me and also slows them and pushes them one quick pace back. I'm leaving after this once I get to those stairs right there because there's really no reason for me to stay here right now. No point in me staying if I'm not gaining any JP and that seems to be the main uh, idea of that dungeon. But yeah, that's awesome. Oh my god. There's a grinding dungeon. That's fucking amazing. Thank you, Mog. I love you, bro. Howdy. This is Harry's Hardware. You think I should buy the legendary bag for 5,000 gil? Yes. Can now carry 48. Ooh. And he just carries titanium gear on its own. Fuck yeah, I'll buy one of those. Because that's six slots there. The best gear money can buy. Right now. It's actually slightly worse by default than the uh, gear I currently have. But, it also, uh... So default 34, default 40. So, plus 6 would put it to 30. It would end, it's gonna end up being slightly stronger than... I'm gonna remove brands from this really quick. Because I really don't need any status preventing. Yeah, poison. Yeah. With the. Ri I'm gonna lose my ability to be able to instantly appraise everything that I see. But on the other hand. I'm gonna... No status ailments will affect me. Welcome. The Master Lure. 
<sighs> You're still not sending to selling turbo ethers, asshole. Welcome to Florida. Maybe I'll care when you start selling turbo ethers, bro. Don't even say anything special to me. Wow. So I'm 11 of 12 on the Mirror of Memory. And the Mirror of Training, I'm missing several here. There appears to still be a lot of dungeons I, have, I can get to. Hey, Raffaello. Chocobo, I've been thinking about going to the outside world. What I did was truly unforgivable, yet everyone's forgiven me. They say there's no use fretting over the past, so I feel like I have to repay their kindness. It's something that even I can do. It's something that only I can do. I just gotta find a way. Thank you, Chocobo. Good, now let me fucking fish. What? There's a seventh letter? Whoops. I got the ma the master lure, so... Master Lear does not want to give me any fish. Yeah, it's another dry ether though. Can't complain. Ah, oh, there we go. Catching a fish with the Master Lear. Better not be one I already have. God damn it. The brooch of memory shimmers, huh? When I check the statue, the brooch of memory shimmers. That's interesting, isn't it? Good. My own memories? With checkpoints? 99 floor dungeon, Maddie. Ray of Hope, cast Protect on Shell. Yeah, and he counts as a flyer, so no wonder I was dealing so much damage to him. That's great. How cute, the game thought it could silence me. Another ribbon collar. Neat.
Doesn't look like there's any actual enemies in this dungeon. It's all just shades. You too. What? So I want to get. I said I was on a... Yes. Oh, haste trap. Sure, why not? Yeah, fine. That, sound, that sounds good. If I get far enough ahead, he'll warp to me. Well, that's interesting. I'm going to be going through a bunch of locales in there, and it is 99 floors with checkpoints, though. There was a checkpoint warper at the top, so that's going to be the new thing to check out. In the meantime, Adamant Talons, which I expected, but not they're not how they don't work how I thought they would. See, the Titanium Talons don't rust, but apparently the Adamant Talons, despite being made from the hardest material in existence, can rust. Anyways, that's going to be it for tonight. Thank you, everyone, who tuned in tonight. Much appreciated. Uh, we beat the game. I'm happy about this. I just noticed I have 20,708 gil in the uh, storage, and I have 207 gil on hand. It's like same three digits. Weird. Anyways, thank you so much. Uh, we'll be back when we're back. Maybe tomorrow night. Maybe not. Maybe with this. Maybe not. We'll figure it out. Thank you everyone who tuned in tonight. And until next time, game on.